Lighting is super good. Well, it's that time of the week, month, year again. I streamed today. Today uh, was Tuesday, October 15th. Um, it's technically Wednesday morning now, like it's 6 a.m. I forgot to edit a video. Well, I finished editing a video, so I'm gonna do that because I got distracted by building a new computer. I'm not actually physically building it, but assembling online on PC Part Picker what I would pick for parts. And uh, I built a Ryzen 9 uh, Gen 3 Ryzen system, if you know what that is. For someone who does my workflow, um, editing, gaming, streaming, all that stuff, Ryzen is a very, very, very good uh, CPU to get. And I priced out a new system for around 2400 bucks. I've been having a lot of trouble with, I mean, I've been, since July, I've been having a lot of trouble with my computer. It's had a lot of problems editing recently, um, audio desyncs, uh, playback stuttering, scrubbing issues. Uh, a lot of it is because my processor is from 2013, from Q2. 2013 so it is quite old uh, you know a six-year-old processor and the rest of my computer is also that old minus my graphics card and um, power supply well and even now my SSD and hard drive are really nice um, but my CPU and motherboard are really, really far behind. So I'm having a lot of trouble with it. Um, even in Apex Legends, I've been having a lot of trouble running the game if I'm not using a controller. It's very weird, it's a very specific problem, but if I use my mouse, um, sometimes the game will be super duper laggy and there is just nothing I can do about it, so I have to use controller, but I want to learn mouse and keyboard really bad. Um, but I just can't simply sometimes. Uh, like tonight, I streamed and was trying to use keyboard and mouse and it would drop to less than 10 frames per second. Um, it would stutter, it would skip, it would be off of the play. Uh, it doesn't do that in every game, just Apex, but it's also the newest game I play, so that's probably why. So I'm throwing around the idea of buying a new computer, which is scary because I just got my laptop a couple months ago for $1,400. And that was so much money. To buy a new computer would be such a large chunk of my money. I would want to get a job. <laughs> but it's vital to the career I want to pursue. And being that I'm only six months in and I'm having this many problems with my current setup. I don't know if it's a good investment. It feels like it would be a great investment, but it's just so much money. It's what it's that time of that time of week, that time of month again, where I'm like, ooh, new computer. That sounds good. It's actually been since April. April was the last time I was really looking into computers. I did it a little bit with Logan when he wanted to build one. My friend Logan, but not nearly to this extent. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm I'm thinking about it. I'm seriously considering it tonight because of how much trouble how much trouble Apex Legends has been giving me and how much trouble Premiere has been giving me. We're gonna go on a little adventure. Um, by that I mean, I'm watching I'm watching a movie called Chef right now, which stars John Favreau. I believe he also directed it. I'm really really hungry, so I'm going to make a pizza. <laughs> by that I mean I'm going to put a pizza in the oven. But I'm gonna take you on a little vlog journey because I feel like I'm always in my office or on my bed when you see me. So we're just gonna go somewhere else. Here we go. Rip that wingman nerf gun, that's, whoops.
So, uh, I just got done streaming for a little over four hours. It's uh, Saturday, Saturday, October 19th, Sunday morning, technically. Uh, I streamed for Titanfall Day. Forgot to change it to say that I was on Xbox instead of PC. I think that kind of drove viewers away, so that's my mistake. But I did stream, and it was actually pretty fun, for me anyway, the game. Uh, the chat was inactive, as usual. Um, people didn't really show up. And one person followed me on Mixer, one person chat once on Twitch. Uh, that's really it, though. I actually did pretty good tonight in Titanfall, and it was a, a nice change of pace instead of getting curb stomped like normal. And I think it's because, honestly, because I have I had eaten before I started streaming, so I wasn't hungry and angry. That actually kind of helped, but now I'm hungry and angry and I got off streaming. Uh, but I need to eat. Uh, but it was uh, a good productive night, you know? I actually felt like I had a good week this week. I relaxed a lot. I know that I didn't do as much work as I'd hoped, but I feel like what I did put out was good and I, my streams have been good um, lengths. Yeah, I don't know, I've just been having a good time. Like, genuinely having a good time making stuff this week. Uh, but what that has allowed me to do, um, since I haven't been spending as much time editing um, as I expected and as I used to, because I'm getting much faster editing the stuff I do make, is I've been watching a lot of new stuff, uh, or movies that I missed out on, or like I just watched the other day, I watched the first Naked Gun, uh, and then I watched two and three, which is, I believe, 22 and a half and 33 and a third, which those movies are actually very funny if you're into slapstick comedy and puns and stuff, a lot of wordplay. Super funny movies. Yeah, I've been finishing watching all my, like, Rooster Teeth content, so I've, like, just had extra time to watch different stuff. I still need to finish all the Netflix Marvel shows, but I can't get through Luke Cage season two. It's just so boring. So it's been super nice to just relax and watch a movie because normally I'm watching like podcasts or let's plays or like tech reviews or editing my own content or streaming my own content. So it's nice to like watch a film. Uh, I guess I'll see you in the next clip. Bye. Dude, today's been such a weird day. Where to start, where to start. It is Monday. Technically, when you're, when I'm recording this and when you're gonna watch it, some crazy stuff happened. Um, I put off streaming for until tomorrow. I played Apex Legends with Brooke and her friend Andrew, which, funny enough, she has a friend named Andrew. Us, us three played, and Jeff was in the call, and we had a lot of fun. You know, we didn't we didn't stream it, but it was uh, it was super fun to meet Andrew and uh, immediately definitely friends. It was just I don't know. It was super cool. Right? It was a good day. You know, we didn't do super great. We won the last game because people died to the ring, which I thought was hilarious. And then we <laughs> we quit playing and I ate some taquitos because I was hungry. I watched Shroud for a while and then Shroud started hosting Madness. Um, I don't know exactly what his Twitch is. I think it's I'm Madness CLG or I'm Madness something. Basically, he's a super, super good Apex player who uh, went pro not long ago and he streams as well. Um, I saw him a long time ago playing with Dizzy. Super good. W one of the best Wraith players, bar none. Stroud hosted him and I was watching because why not, right? I, I was putting making this vlog off. So he gets the boost of uh, viewers and stuff from Shroud and people are are, you know, following and subbing and as sort of stuff starts to fall down, he talks about Twitter and kind of explains why he wants to, uh, why he wants to stream and why he likes broadcasting so much. And it, I really related to it. He's like, he's always liked broadcasting and, and video and he wants to like make a difference and the money isn't necessarily the biggest thing. He just wants to, you know, build a community and entertain people and make a difference which is something that I really subscribe to. You know, I want it to be my job, but I also want it to be like, I want to have a community that I can hang out with and play games with. Theoretically, if I could go pro, I would, but I'm just not that good enough at games. <laughs> like, but he went pro and he, he talked about that stuff. So I followed, um, I liked his personality enough. I followed him on Twitter and tweeted at him and he was going through um, tweets live on stream uh, in, in between games, seeing what people were talking about, whatever. And uh, mine came up and he retweeted it, which was super awesome. He doesn't have a super large amount of followers. Um, he's more got a following on you know Twitch and uh, probably YouTube, I assume, for his content, not necessarily Twitter. But I don't know, just a nice little, cool little thing that happened, you know? Pro player, one of the best players 
for Wraith. He's on a pro team. He's a streamer. Just retweeted me. Um, here's the clip. Thank you guys for following on the Twitter, by the way. I really appreciate that. Thank you, Andrew. This means a lot, bro. It means a lot, man. Thank you so much for the kind words. I appreciate that. So yeah, that happened. It was kind of nuts. It was a nice little bookend for today. I talked about this, or, or I started to talk about this um, in the vlog last week where I kind of went on a rant. It's like the small, it's the small little things like this um, that really keep me going and keep me motivated to make content and stream and all that fun stuff. It's just, it's one of those things, man. One of those things. Just gotta, I have one breakout thing. That's all I need. One breakout thing. <sighs> I wonder what it'll be. Anyway, while I'm recording right now, I'm gonna go over uh, this week and kind of what happened with the work time breakdown. It was actually pretty good. Week 20. Oh my God, I've been doing this for 20 weeks already. It's five months ish monday was a good day pretty good four and a half hours most of it was streaming only an hour of editing i'm, I'm getting my editing time really low on these vlogs i'm also not putting music in i'm not trying as hard but you know sometimes the music doesn't really fit and i just don't really have music that fits so you know it depends artistic choice right tuesday was nuts because i streamed for so long i had eight hours and seven minutes i streamed for five hours and seven minutes um i also did editing for an hour and 45 plus filming whatever wednesday uh, I didn't do anything. I didn't make a video for the Skull HQ. I, did, I didn't have anything. Um, and it was just too late by the time I thought of something. Uh, whoops. Thursday, I did do some stuff. An hour and a half. Uh, mostly editing. Then on math days. Friday, I did three hours and 14 minutes of work. All of it streaming. Uh, Saturday, I did four hours and 20 minutes. AO of work. All of it streaming. So a grand total of 21 hours and 42 minutes this week. Pretty nuts. Uh, streaming really bumps up my numbers a lot. I'm really trying to put time into streaming because I feel like, and I've said this before, that's the place where I have the best possibility of growth. Quite honestly, YouTube is so saturated with people um, and it's so mainstream that I think the only way to grow there is to grow somewhere else first. So I'm hoping that I can get Twitch working out um, I want to start streaming three days a week for sure, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, but I'm not uh, going to commit to that yet. That's it for this video. Like if you liked it, favorite the video if it's your favorite. If you want to check out my Twitch, please click the link down below. It's twitch.tv slash theskullhq. I need to reach affiliate. That's three viewers average per month of streams. I can reach affiliate and start earning money. That would be amazing if you'd come and join me. I play a lot of Titanfall and Apex Legends and... Uh, Sometimes Minecraft, other games. I'll see you later. Take care.